Police officer actually had some good instincts finding a car linked to a suspicious person, and within moments, he found himself interrupting a burglary in progress. The residents of a home in Orinda returned to their property hours after police stumbled across a burglary there while they were away. Yeah, we, well, if we go talk to anyone, I need to know what's going on. Police asked them to examine a number of items as crime scene technicians scoured their five-bedroom home for evidence. They did not want to comment. Sir, what's it all began when Orinda police received calls of a suspicious person on Knickerbocker Lane. At about 8.50, an Orinda officer spotted this Chevy Camaro linked to that person on the driveway of a home on Lloyd Lane off Moraga Way. I've learned the plate comes back to a 2003 Honda. And just seconds later, that officer reported that he had intercepted several suspects at gunpoint as they came out of the front door with items stolen from the home. The three dropped the items, went back into the home, and ran out the back door. The officer arrested one of the suspects and requested more officers. Police in Orinda are part of the Contra Costa County Sheriff's Office, and so deputies and Lafayette and Danville police converged on the scene. BART, San Ramon, and Moraga police also showed up to help. Part of busy Moraga Way was shut down during the search. Residents were told to stay alert for any suspicious activity. The police are here in en masse. I would assume they have it under control. A second suspect was found hiding under a shed. Our cameras caught police taking one of the suspects who had been tased from a stretcher and into a police car. A BART police officer with his canine searched the property and went door to door looking for signs of the third suspect. Officers also used a drone to search the neighborhood by air. It repeatedly played a recording saying the sheriff's office had the area surrounded and that they should come out with nothing in their hands or else they risk getting bit by the canine. But ultimately, that third suspect escaped. One of the suspects in custody has been identified as 30-year-old Dennis Windham, who is on parole for burglary out of San Francisco. Live in studio, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News. All right, so again, Henry, they arrested two people. They're still looking for a third. That's correct. All right, Henry, thank you.